It's time for this week's group challenge dance. I bet you're dying to know what the prize is. You get to make all the assignments. Picking who gets what dance in the competition is one of the most important things I do. That's a lot of power, moms. Survival of the fittest, the smartest, the best. It's not the end of the world yet, but who is going to survive this challenge? Who do you think wants it the most? I think they all want it. Maybe mommy wants it. Elizabeth, right through the heart. In the group dance challenge, Elizabeth, it wasn't her best day. Hadley, you clearly are not the best technical dancer here. Madison, I think today you were the technical master. However, you never look me in the eye. So, the winner or should I say survivor, of the group challenge dance is... Hadley. I'm a little nervous on what Yvette's gonna pick because we all know everyone's here to win the competition. Okay, so we have a jazz duet, a jazz funk duet, Contemporary solo and hip hop trio. Do you want the solo? Because she oh says she God. wants the best for everybody, right? We'll see, oh, right? Oh, we'll yes. see how much she wants the best. You know that Elizabeth and Amanda really don't hip hop. So you've got to kill it. People forget I have not shared anything of Hadley's weaknesses, but they've been putting it out on the table what dance style they don't like. There's the big side. I am concerned about some of the other mothers seeing their child's dance assignment, but I'm definitely gonna survive this week. Hmm. Originally, I had Hadley in the trio, but at the last minute, we took Asia off of the solo. I mean, hey, it's an opportunity for Hadley to stand out. Mommy, 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 Jazz Funk by Anthony. Yeah. I knew they would put us together. Machines versus humans. Machines, we are you, lady. I'm not surprised that Yvette paired Brianna with Asia. I know she's trying to think that because Brianna's one of the strongest dancers here, that she's just going to kill Asia on stage as a duet. But I think it's going to backfire on Yvette. It's so funny because after the last trio, Richie's like, oh, we really want to see you bring it again. Oh, Elizabeth yes. said, she goes, I hope I get another chance at hip hop there so that go. I can show them that I can Go-go. bring it. Third so time's a charm. You gave her exactly Third what she wanted. You Thank what? you. We, we aim to play. I'm Third really excited time. to see her solo. Yeah. Yeah. We're so excited. And having chosen that solo for her kid, she better be able to put her money where her mouth is. That thing, let me just tell you, that better come out 100% or she's going to look like a fool. First up is a hip hop trio about a military nation. Here's Lexine, Elizabeth, and Amanda. I thought there were a few dumb mistakes, things that you know better. I didn't see good technique. I think that you toe in a little bit. You should walk in your everyday life turned out. 
I'm gonna turn it over to Richie. Of course, you feel like you're under the bus because you got put into a category that you know is not your strong point, but you were still off on the feet. We're still watching you perform. You have to start on the same foot, the feet and knees have to go at the same height, and you have to stop at the same time. I think that there was a lot of things that need to be worked on. Our next performance is this week's challenge winner, Hadley. Let's see if her survival skills hold up. Just lay down with those feet. Abby, I'm reading your facial expression, and you don't seem that happy. Should I say roadkill? <laughs> roadkill? Really? Hadley, do you realize that you were laying there on the stage with your feet completely sickled? Then you proceeded to do a bridge and come up with your arms not anywhere near your ears. I didn't see good technique. All that floor work, Hadley, not once did you have your instep pressed down on the floor. So why did you do it wrong? It's just a habit that I'm trying to Bad break. habit. Right. Make a new mistake. Thank you, judges. Hadley, great job. Thank you. We'll see you back out here. Oh, my god. Holy crap. I know Yvette's freaking out right now. Holy crap. It's going to be amazing. Don't worry about it. OK, babe. We said we wanted the beginning change. So she didn't like the hair. She didn't like the costume. I've had a horrendous week. And the last thing that I want to do is go sit and face those moms. Mm -hmm. That's Rotating. Wow. I wish you had that accent. Did you hear that? Yeah. That's the first word out of her mouth. Our last performance of the night is a jazz funk number about the battle between machines and humans. This is Asia and Brianna. that Brianna is one of our top-notch dancers here in the end. So I think Hadley and her mother were trying to prove their point and put Asia up against yes. Brianna. The best yes. Dancer. yes. And it backfired on them because... Yes. Performance-wise, it worked. Whatever app you're selling, I'm buying. <laughs> Asia, Lexi, tonight you are the best of the best. Congratulations, you will be moving on in the competition. The skill was survival, and she told me she is going to survive, and I'm so proud of her right now. Elizabeth, tonight, by far, was the worst we've ever seen you perform. Hadley? I'm very disappointed in you. You gave yourself a solo tonight, and it backfired on you. Were you really trying to challenge the dancers to do better, or were you trying to sabotage some people? No, they can rise to the occasion. Really? And some of them did. Elizabeth, today is not your day. Sweetheart, you are going home and on to much, much, much more. You did not survive tonight, but let's hope you win the war. Thank you. Hey, listen. <laughs> this is not me. <laughs> You're going to win the war, OK? What I'll remember most about this experience is the joy that it brought my daughter. Listen to me, Elizabeth. You already won by being here. I don't care. This is your this first. Meant the world. 
for me. <laughs> How they should have been it. the one that left. Yeah. She was horrible. There's going to be so many more things, so much more this world has to offer you. I don't give a crap. OK, stop that right now. <laughs>